Hey guys, you're watching one and only. My name is AJ. Welcome back to the episode of Let's Build a City, episode 193. Does that mean we're getting close to 200? I think it does. We're going to be building the reception building today. Uh, I've changed my mind. We're not going to go with a dark wood. We're actually going to go with a light wood building with a dark wood roof on it. Stairs and slabs and rain and we're ready to go so uh i'm going to keep the building at this sort of shape but uh let's change the blocks out first yes i'm going to keep those dark oak blocks underneath the ground boy is that going to annoy some of you guys it always does uh, and what i'm also going to do i sort of forgot about like uh toilets they do usually have toilets at the camping ground that is, so you don't need to like use the one in your caravan for whatever reason i don't really know why as you can see I don't really understand camping too much. I've never been, and I don't really like it. My granddad, my grandparents used to have a big caravan, but only went once or twice, and I never slept there. Um, I don't. I, I like my bed. I think that's what the main thing is. What I'm gonna do is I'm gonna put toilets like on the end of the building here, um, so like everybody can use them. We're gonna put the door in the middle. It's gonna be a nice double wide door in there, and make it a nice wooden shack. I'll make it some normal stairs as well to go above the door, just so it looks nice. Something like that, okay? This goes back to the old days of, uh, of Minecraft when you used to build everything out of wood. I might go with double. Nah, I don't need to go with double high ones. Uh, all buildings used to be made out of wood back then. In fact, let's do... I was thinking about having, like, a little cafe on one of the, on, on the right-hand side. I think that would be nice. Like a little cafe, just so you can get, like, a little tea or coffee or something like that. Maybe even a bacon bite in the morning if you're lucky. Sometimes they have those. So we'll have that like that. Uh, at the back side, I'll just have a window for the chefs. So that's going to be where the kitchen's going to be. That's going to be where a little seating area is going to be. And this is going to be the receptionist area. So they don't need a window on the back because we're going to have book stands and stuff like that. And I might put a little single window on the side, followed by a nice double window on the right. All right, there's our plan. That's our, that's our sort of floor of it, if you like. Uh, and now what we need to do is the roof. Now, the roof is going to be... A little bit tricky. I think I want to have the roof up here, so it might be, in fact, easier to first put down a layer that I can place some some um, blocks onto. Uh, but I want the roof to sort of stick out over the entrance, especially, uh, and have a sort of, I don't know, a walk under area? Is that, I don't know what you'd really call it, uh, but I always forget what you call it. <laughs> we'll have a roof that wraps around. I don't want to have, like, any, any T's on the edges. So it's going to come out like that. And then we're going to carve it out here, I think. Just bring it out. I might want to bring it out a little bit more. Like that. And then maybe we'll have a slab like that. Just so this part comes out the most. That's two blocks away from the entrance. So it means it's going to be there. And let's wrap this around the building. Like this. Nice simple roof. Um, do I want to put like a peak? No. I was thinking about if I wanted to have like a little peak on somewhere, but I don't think we do. I could put one on this side. No, 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 no. Let's not. Okay, something like that. And then the next layer up is going to fold out like this. And like that. Go all the way around. Wooden buildings, I always find look really weird, especially for this whole series. Nearly 200 episodes I've been building out of pretty much everything apart from wood. So doing a wooden building for me, it seems so out of place. But in a campsite, I think it makes a lot of sense. Now, on this part, I'm not going to drop down this way. I'm going to make it continue on forward. Okay, like that. And then what we can do is I can go underneath. I can put some full blocks under there. And then grab a nice slab, like this one. We'll just have a nice lowered down flat portion here. Just, just as a little bit of a different design there. Okay carry on with the stairs now the middle part is going to go right up to a point so we need to keep going up and up and up until uh, until they meet what's going to be this way like that so hard starting off like there and that one okay this looks like it's going to be the last layer for the peak it might be the last layer for the whole lot i might put another flat roof on the top it oh oh that could be nice hold on what if we left the ends um with a t on it instead of doing the t all the way up we'll do the t just a little way up hmm that could be really nice okay 
like that. And then we'll put these in here. And there. I'll add another one there just for design. Forgot about that one. There we go. That could look really nice. And down here. And then the slabs to finish up on the top. I don't know if I like that. I might make this into um, wooden planks instead. Wooden slabs instead of the grey. Because we haven't got any other grey on the building. So it doesn't really make sense to have it there. Whoops. Uh, oh dear. Too quick. Placing too fast. Okay. And that one. Not that one. That one. Slabs. There, reach it. Okay. Stair, stair, stair. Stair, stair, stair. Hey, that's just a nice little... I like that. I like that a lot. Okay, uh, on this area, we'll go... Probably just stairs at the front here. I need to fill this part in. Whoa, stop deleting the wrong block. Okay. Uh, and then we want to have fences... Not gates, fences. I'm going to place the fence along here. Like that. Up there. and I might do the whole lot there and there as well. No. Maybe take those ones out. Or maybe put those ones in and take those ones out. Oh yeah, I like that. And then we'll have it come down. There. And there. Have I got a different fence? I've got a grey fence. It doesn't really work. It blends into the house behind though, doesn't it? Okay, let's change the let's change the house or the building colour. Let's change it from oak to like a uh, sandstone or something like that. Pause to replace plank with sandstone. 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 Okay, I like that better. Yeah, now the wood stands out a little bit more. I'm happy with that. We'll put another one there. And I think that's a good block choice change. Oh, no, not there. We didn't put the slabs along. Like that. Okay, nice one. Maybe change the bottom block now. To... Maybe a cobblestone could work put it there so I get the back as well um duck wood. maybe this one 24 one uh replace sandstone with 24 one just so we get a little bit of a stone bottom on it a little bit of a foundation I like that a lot that's cool uh stairs to go above the windows I think the building needs that oops wrong one there and there. I like how it has like a brick at the bottom as well. Very, very nice. I think there's one more, isn't there? Two more. There we go. Perfect. Glass. Go with white stained glass here. Nice and bright. We don't we want white, not black. I use black on like darker areas. But this we want to be nice and bright and, 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 and friendly looking. It's not a zombie campsite like the last one that we built. All right, cool. Uh, that's where you'd like hang a sign or something like that. Maybe some lights on there would be nice. But uh, I think we're okay here. Do we want to do an interior? Do we need to do an interior? Oh, I need that there. Um, I'll do an interior later on. We're not going to bother about it now. Let's have some nice decoration now. Leaves. We need to think about like leaves everywhere as well. Because they are, they are nice areas. Now we've gone with a, a more sort of worn away sort of effect on ours uh with like a more worn sort of ground uh, i don't maybe know if that's the right decision maybe we should have gone with um uh, a nice sort of tarmac look i don't know it's hard isn't it i like that though that's a really nice entrance and then we'll have maybe a little bit of gravel just blended in here like that just to the path of the door there. Blending in a load of different blocks is a really nice thing. I like that building. I really like that building. That looks really cool. 
So let's get some toilets on the side here, just some nice simple ones up on this wall. Uh, we'll go with the sort of wooden style ones, I think. Perfect, look at that. Uh, maybe not out of that wood. Maybe we should go out of um, the oak wood, though. Oh, I had it on me. Whoops. Something like that. Obviously, we don't want windows. That sounds like a terrible idea. Uh, and then stairs. Maybe we'll go with these ones just so they're different again. And then maybe just flat across the top. Or do we want to have like a little... Mm. Slabs. Can I do anything with slabs at all? Like that. Maybe fold that one around. Okay. I like that. And then... I don't want that one to be facing that way. I want it to sort of come out a little bit. And then we'll go back to some slabs again. Slabs. Yeah, I think that looks pretty nice. We'll get the block to go in here. And a block to go in there. Put some nice doors on it. That one. Bunk, bunk. Beautiful. And then for the toilet, I don't know. We'll probably just use a cauldron. Something simple like that. Uh, for the ground stone nice and cheap boom okay so we've got some toilets in there male and female toilet just to make things like easy for people can i put a sign on there that would be cool sign i don't use signs all that often uh men's women's yeah okay i like that uh, now, so we've got toilet amenities, little cafe will be in there, receptionist to sign in. Uh, I would like a really nice, I mean, we've got the, I want to do more of this sort of leaf stuff, but it's really hard to do that kind of detail before you've got the caravans in. So maybe we need to start putting more caravans in now. Let's grab this one. Bloop. And let's grab this one Bloop. and then we'll copy and paste it where do i where do i want to stand do i want to stand at the back i think i want to stand at the back right we're just going to place a few of these down in some different spots so let's go with one here and let's rotate it 180 degrees not no minus 180 there we go and then we'll paste it this way so we so there's one the doors on the wrong side and we'll need to fix the buttons and stuff like that but uh that's that's, that's really no biggie is it <laughs> oh it took the stairs i'm surprised it even took the stairs and then i'll rotate it by oh, what way would it be minus 90 if i stand here would it paste the right way nope Alrighty. and now paste there we go there's another one in there and obviously we'll change the colours up and stuff in a moment. Uh, and then what we'll do is grab this one. The smaller one. I think two different variations would be fine. We can always make them slightly different to each other if we, if we wanted to. And then we'll copy. Rotate 180 degrees. Get rid of that button. Oh, I got rid of the wheel. Whoops. Paste. Oh, I killed another cow. Uh, rotate 90. Where's 90? There is. Is it facing this way or the other way? I always get it wrong. Uh, nope. Undo. Maybe I didn't need, I didn't need to rotate at all, did I? Uh, mm, 90. Paste. Yeah, better. Okay. Doors are facing the wrong way on some of them, but it's fine. And then we'll rotate one. 90. Paste. Wrong way. <laughs> Isn't it always the way? One eight. No, not 190. Oh my jeez. Paste. There we go. We got it the right way at last. Uh, and then maybe one more at the end here. 
paste. Okay, cool. I think that's enough caravans for our caravan pack. I know it's not big, but it doesn't need to be big. We don't need to go crazy. Maybe one more here. Maybe one more here. And we'll rotate it around the other way again. Rotate 180. Come over here. Paste. Undo. Come over here. Maybe we're too far. Redo. Oh, man. There you go. Paste. My fingers are working too quick. There you go. So we've got a load of caravans. Now we can change up the colours just to make them look a little bit different. We'll grab that one. And pause to what is red clay. I'll always keep red on me and I'll always keep lime on me so we can change them. Uh, let's make a pink one. 159.2. Uh, replace. I can't remember what it was. 14. Replace 159.14 with 159.2. We got a pink one. We'll have this one. It'll be 159. I don't know. Let's just make up numbers. Three. There you go. Blue one. We'll have this one. Pause two. Let's try four. Yellow one. Good. Let's try. Oh, we want. Uh, th uh, what is it? I'd like a. Re I'd, I'd like a proper blue one. Yeah, this one. 35-3. 35-3. There we go. A nice blue one. And then this one. So this is all the small ones now changed, isn't it? Pause. Two. Um, let's just change, figure out a colour. Seven. Brown? Yeah, why not brown? I wouldn't normally choose, but sure. Uh, and then we got two green ones to change as well. So we'll take that one. And... Pause two. What number is that? 159.5. 159.5 five with 159.8. Okay, it's more of a, like a tanned colour. And then... Don't get the other one. Well, it doesn't matter, does it? Uh, 11? Yeah, sure. So I've got loads of different colours in there. That looks really nice. Really, really nice. Uh, but we can put... We need to fix the wheels. And, in fact, let me do that. Let me fix all the wheels and all the doors so they're facing a nice way. And I should be back. Alright, so now all the ladders are on the right side. And the doors are all correct. And the wheels look all right again. Uh, actually made a big difference. I really, really like it. Now it's time to spruce up the middle area a little bit. We're going to put some nice sort of dividing um, bushes up in some corners. Something like that. Maybe a little one that goes along here. It just makes the whole place look really nice and pretty. Just nice simple ones. They don't need to be big. Uh, something like, like that. Oops. Where else? One down here. Uh, one over here. Just makes it feel a little bit more private, doesn't it? Just the the people here. Okay, really nice. One up there. Definitely one up there. A nice curved one. Yeah. Okay, beautiful. Beautiful. Uh, nice little sort of gravel again. Uh, paths going to the toilets. Like that. Oh, we've got a hole. <laughs> okay, nice one going there. Uh, and then I think we probably still want to keep beautiful. Ah, oh, it looks so nice. I really, really like that. Uh, one more down here. And line up with the other one. There we go. Perfect. Still got the road and stuff to do. Still a lot of work left here, but it is looking really nice. Flowers. Let's get some flowers going. We'll get some of those ones. We'll get some of them ones. We'll get some of these ones. We'll get some of them ones. Some of these ones. Some of them ones. Some of them ones. Some of them ones. Oops. And some of them ones. Okay. Now, I'm not going to go with my normal sort of, my, my normal routine here. We're just going to go with, we're going to keep one. And I'm going to place them down pretty randomly in this, in the open area. Not on the road. But uh, like behind anywhere where we've got um, hedges. 
I'm going to put all those down. We're going to go around with each one. So maybe it's probably best if I do this off camera because this might take a little while to do. All I'm going to do is just keep, keep it behind the hedges here, behind the caravans. Make it look really nice. I'll do that. I'll be back. All right. That has transformed the place. Really, really nice amount of flowers here. Just makes it look a little bit more welcoming because we've got the dirty sort of dirt road where maybe the holiday home isn't quite um not there maybe the holiday home isn't quite sort of well off enough it's not sort of that making enough money to have a nice sort of driveway uh, but the flowers definitely bring up the prestige uh, a little bit yeah you know i mean it makes it look really nice i love it i think it looks great what we need to do now is some uh entrances to the woods that we're going to place behind so uh, some roots that go through i don't know what block we're going to use maybe we stick with the gravel maybe the gravel's a good way to do it let's um grab a tool maybe would be the easiest way and a brush cylinder of gravel three <laughs> and do um maybe gravel isn't a good idea we definitely need grass in there too um what's another like block that's like gravel but doesn't have that sort of effect and a site now the one one i think it's one one two we'll try one one two one one two and grass yeah and maybe it's a little bit too big undo and we'll go with one yeah okay undo we need to be careful not to click on flowers otherwise it'll do that so we're just going to have some nice oops paths that just lead up just random little roots that sort of flow around each other. Yeah. Just when we're walking through it, it doesn't quite look as boring. Then we'll have one that comes down here. One that comes through there. Oops. Undo, undo. Undo. There we go. <laughs> Let's get that one in. One that comes up and around here. Maybe off that way a little bit. Back round. Yeah. There we go. So some different routes that people can take. Once we get the trees up, that'll make a lot more sense at the moment. It looks really quite ugly. But imagine a bunch of trees in there and you just sort of follow your way through. That would be really, really... I'm loving it. Uh, trees, I think, are the next step that we need to have. I'm going to place some trees down. Uh, in fact, I'll put them down off camera because we're going to be getting short on time this episode. I'm going to go with these three different ones. I'm going to just place the saplings down and I might even wait for them to grow a little bit or something. Okay? Okay, that took about the length of two whole episodes to do, but boy, was it worth a look at that. Having the three different trees was a really good decision. Having the three different shades of green makes it look absolutely fantastic. They're still growing as well. It isn't even done. You'll still see trees pop up all the time. They must be close to, I don't know, a couple of thousand saplings that I put down, and it's just made a huge difference. It looks finished all we need now is a road that leads up and joins it and i'm happy i mean it just looks fantastic doesn't it really really nice but yeah trees are popping up all the time and uh slowing down my computer when like 17 trees all pop up at once uh because of all the sort of shade of stuff that's going on at the moment making all the tree leaves wobble look wobble 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 it looks so cool though hey all right, guys, I'm going to leave it there after recording or after being off camera for about 50 minutes planting trees. I need to go and have a rest and maybe a little nap. If you guys enjoyed the episode, hit that like button. If you haven't already, then feel free to subscribe. We shall see you in the next one where maybe all the trees will be done.